Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today I am reviewing the Super Saiyan 3 Goku. And you know it's Super Saiyan 3 because he's got this great banana mane. I like to call his hair bananas because it's bananas. It's literally bananas. It looks like bananas. When you get to the shot of his hair, you're looking at a bundle of bananas in my mind. Funko, wow, you agree? Funko, I don't think, can mess up anime characters because they're two-dimensional characters. They're not three-dimensional characters. Now, thank God we never got a live-action version of these characters. But if they do, hopefully they do better than Evolution. But it's a very simple character to sculpt. I'm glad that they at least sculpted those eyebrows on because those eyebrows are prominent in the TV show. And just, you know, yeah, they are prominent, aren't they? Just they, Those eyebrows are what stick out to me the most. Those angry eyebrows. And... I love that Funko decided to start doing poses for these characters because it adds character to the character. You know what they're doing. He's trying to do the Kamehameha wave, you know. He's getting ready to do that. He's getting into his stance. Overall, the sculpt is great. I love the banana hair. There's not any paint flaws on this pop. There might be one or two in some areas, but overall, this is a solid pop. I am a little exhausted with multiple characters from this series when we have tons of characters that they can make from Dragon Ball Z, but that's always going to be a common complaint for me. Let me know what you guys think of this Funko Pop in the comments down below, and I'll see you guys again tomorrow. Bye, everybody.